Hi and welcome back to another video of Medic Notes. This video is on guidelines of dating ultrasound scan. Calculating gestation age based on menstrual history is often risky. Many women are uncertain of their dates, and even when the menstrual history is known to be correct, individual variation in the time of ovulation can alter the length of a cycle from 25 to 35 days. All pregnant mothers should have an early dating ultrasound, earlier than 20 weeks, if there is no problem with resources. The indications for early dating scan are, unsure of dates, having irregular menses, on hormonal contraception up to three months before pregnancy, or amenorrheic since last childbirth. The gestational sac will be the first structure to be seen. It is usually seen early, less than six weeks. It should only be used before the appearance of the embryo. Use mean sac diameter. Most reliable up to 14 mm MSD. Generally accepted up to 25 mm MSD. Be careful not to be mistaken with pseudo-sac which suggest ectopic pregnancy. Accuracy is plus minus 5 days. Repeat scan after 10 to 14 days to establish viability. Later on, once an embryo is seen, CRL should be measured. It can be used up to 14 weeks. Be careful not to include the yolk sac in the measurement. Measure pole to pole if the fetus is still not well formed yet. Measure in true mid-sagittal view in a well formed fetus. Accuracy plus minus 5 days. No need repeat scan to confirm the date. Between 12 to 14 weeks, if there is difficulty in obtaining a true mid-sagittal plane, then a composite measurement of FLBPD or FLHC can be used, accuracy plus minus 7 days. From 14 weeks onwards, femur length, and biparietal diameter, or head circumference should be measured. Use composite date based on FLBPD or FLHC. Accuracy plus minus 10 days. If there is a significant difference between the femur and head measurement, consider fetal anomaly, either skeletal or brain abnormalities. For guidelines on deciding date, up to 14 weeks gestational age, use gestational sac or crown rump length. Use LMP if ultrasound date is within plus minus 5 days of LMP. Otherwise, use ultrasound REDD for gestational age 12 to 14 weeks, use FLBPD or FLHD. Use LMP if scan date is within plus minus 7 days of LMP. Otherwise, use ultrasound REDD for gestational age 14 to 20 weeks, use FLBPD or FLHD. Use LMP if scan date is within plus minus 10 days of LMP. Otherwise, use ultrasound REDD next, for dating scan after 20 weeks in uncomplicated pregnancy, ultrasound date is used as a reference. Take AC measurement as well. If AFI is normal, and AC corresponds to FLBPD or FLHC, repeat growth scan in two weeks. If subsequent two-weekly scan is normal, no need further scans until 38 weeks. In between, scans for other obstetric, indications should still be done as indicated. Repeat AFL at 40 weeks. Consider lol if AFI at 40 weeks is abnormal or low. That's all for this video. Thank you.